I've solved thousands of cases in my time, but this one had me on edge. I was up hours on end, sleepless. One man's farmhouse is another man's mystery. Today, we figure out why did the chicken cross the road. Late one afternoon in my town, a chicken was found dead on the side of the road. Cops came to the area and asked witnesses if they saw anything or if they knew what was going on. Body was taken to the morgue, and it was my job to figure out what happened and why. Now normally their goal was to be to get to the other side, right? That's, that's what's normal, that's what they do. But the tracks stop here. That doesn't make any sense. Why, why do they stop here? What was his goal? What was his purpose? My initial thought process was to retrace his steps and try to see if I can figure out what was going on before the time of his death. Now, this is a process that must be done delicately and in a serious manner at all times. Well, that wasn't that hard. That doesn't make any sense. It should be that easy. Shortly afterward, a store clerk came up to me and said he had some information about the ordeal. I told him to come with me so I can ask him a couple of questions. Good afternoon, sir. Hello, sir. I'm going to ask you a couple of questions and I want you to answer them as honestly as you can. Mm -hmm. Hi. So I talked to the guy for about a good 10-15 minutes, asked him a couple of questions just to see what he knew. Um, he said that he worked at the local store, I actually saw the chicken almost daily, coming in to buy, him, buy stuff. Nothing, nothing too out of the ordinary. But then he told me that the chicken had told him before he left that he was going to attempt something bold. Something that he'd never done before. And that's when it hit me. I knew almost immediately then. I thanked him for his time, and I walked over to the store, found out there was a security camera there. I went to go check it out, and here's what I saw. And from that moment on, I knew chicken was playing chicken. Simple as that. He took a dare. And it ended up costing him. Life lessons, kids. You don't do these kind of things. That's not safe. It's not safe at all. Well, it looks like we solved the case. My work here is done. Time to cluck out.